try to tell you you ain't ready. Have you ever seen a man not afraid to die? Gave his life for a dream. Born hustler, so the game conceived. A cage beast, but now I'm free. How can you blame me? I was born for this. The game chose me. Now I've been training for this my whole life. Carpe diem, huh? Seize the moment, right? Right. We gon' turn up and rock plenty ice. This is our time. Yeah, I'm about that life. I'm a street dude, teach dudes to think quicker. Would take over the world, but you I dream bigger. Never satisfied, I'm trying to be richer. And pour out a little bit for those who ain't with us. Ready, ready. I don't get ready, I stay ready. Cause the consequences is heavy. My man D said he would never quit. Even though the thing's heavy, we push like a 7-7 Chevy. Boy, ready, ready. My whole click since 06 was on the bottom. Now we running this. Grind hard when the low gets heavy. The money was slow, but now it's steady. You boys is not ready. Hello to all Tiger fans watching on MCTV channel 611 and 11 as WHS TV brings you the 2023 Beat McKinley Rally live from the WHS main gym. I'm Xavier Bassett and along with me is Lana Fisher. How are you doing today, Lana? I'm doing good. Again, today's coverage of Beat McKinley Rally is just part of our annual Beat McKinley Channel program. We wish to thank all of our sponsors for their support again this year. You can feel the energy in the room right now. Everyone's excited for this big game tomorrow. The whole school's been really pumped up all week. Our decorations are all set up and everything. Everyone's just been preparing to meet the Bulldogs. Um, as a former cheerleader, this week has been really great for them since the cheerleaders did put up the posters in the cafeteria but they've been really pumped up for this. Just to thank WHS principal Mr. Launchlanger, along with the assistant principals Mrs. Parr, Mr. McConnell, and Mr. Thornsberry, and our dean of students Mr. Lino for the guidance and support all year long.
Be sure to catch the replays of this year's Maslin McKinley game starting this Sunday, October 22nd, and continuing into next week. Be sure to watch WHS on WHS TV on MCTV channel 611 and 11 for all the additional replay dates and times.
Now we're going to give it up for the captains, Chase Bond, Cody Fair, and Dewan Owens. How are you guys feeling today? You can be louder than that. Let me get another one. How are you guys feeling today? Hey, we've been preparing for this since January 1st, and I can promise you tomorrow at 2 o'clock, we'll be ready. But I have one question. Are you guys ready to watch the Tigers beat the Bulldogs tomorrow? Go Tigers, beat McKinley. Hey, are you guys ready for tomorrow? Hey, y'all better be there at 2 o'clock, because when the Tigers run out, we're going to do two things. One, we're going to pound the pups. Two, we're going to bring home that belt for the eighth year in a row. Go Tigers, be McKinley. How y'all doing? Y'all can be louder than that. How y'all doing? All right, I was laying in bed last night and I dozed off and I had a dream that we beat McKinley 14 to three. But then I woke up and I was sad. But then I remembered that it's only a dream and I started to cheer up. Cause we're gonna beat McKinley more than that tomorrow. Get loud!
and that dance was really awesome for the village idiots to do. What's up, everybody? How y'all feeling? My name is Nathan. I'm representing the Great American Rivalry Series. We are super excited to be back here once again for what is the best rivalry in all of North America. We are so excited for the game tomorrow, so make sure you guys are there, loud, getting hyped. See if you guys can bring this home for the eighth time in a row. Best of luck tomorrow. All right, next up we have the cheerleaders who are going to give us a chant. So listen to them. It's time. Staff, come on out.
was really funny to see some of the teachers do what the cheerleaders do, making them do jumps and tumbling. Congratulations to the seniors.
Now up, we have the VIs versus the cheerleaders in a tug of war. Three, two, one. When you play football for the Maslin Tigers, you play for three things. You play for yourself, you play for your family, and you play for your teammates. But on Saturday at 2 o'clock, you play for the city of Maslin. And when you walk off the field, you're going to have earned the right to say a great phrase in the English language. Maslin beats McKinley.
now we have a race. We need two from each grade. We need Melody and Jaren from the ninth grade, Tasia and Abby from the sophomores, Kevin Bauer and Mikey Villafranca from the juniors, and Natalie Barlow and Megan Dingy from the seniors. Ready, set, go! Switch and come back. All right, guys, we're gonna, shh, we're gonna do some chants here. All right, <laughs> who's all going Saturday? Let's go! All right, I'm gonna need everyone quiet. Repeat after me. I, I believe, I believe, I believe that, I believe that we, I believe that we will, I believe that we will win. Everybody be there tomorrow. Let's go. Go Tigers. All right, let's get a big round of applause for our Tiger Nation step team.
Next up, a special performance by the cheerleaders.
Let's bring out those VIs again for some musical chairs. That's one out. See you, Gavin.
I would like to thank our WHS TV crew for their hard work during tonight's rally. Your camera operators today were Trevor Lake and Miguel Reyes Valencia. And your announcers today were Lana Fisher and yours truly, Xavier Bissett. Plus, a big thank you to our two media arts Hello. instructors, Mr. Sheets and Mr. Farrell, and special assistant for this production, Mr. DeWalt. Thanks for watching today's rally. Go Tigers, beat McKinley. Do you like pizza? Then make your way to Cross's Pizza on Amherst, located at 915 Amherst Road, Northeast. Krause's is the best pizza place in all of Maslin. They offer their beautifully handcrafted pizza, fresh ingredients, and perfectly cooked crust that'll make you say yum. Call 832-2242 or visit their website at thatsgoodpizza.com. Doring Vision Center is a primary care optometry clinic located in downtown Maslin. We have an optical department with a wide variety of eyeglass frames. From budget packages to designer brands, we have it all. Doring Vision Center uses the latest technology and fit all types of contact lenses. We treat eye disease conditions and will take emergency eye visits. Most insurances are accepted and same-day appointments may be available. Doring Vision Center. See our offices in Maslin or New Philadelphia. Yeah. A man not afraid to die Gave his life for a dream Born hustler, so the game conceived A caged beast, but now I'm free How can you blame me? I was born for this, the game chose me Now I've been training for this my whole life Carpe diem, huh, cease the moment Right, right, we gon' turn up And rock plenty ice, this is our time Yeah, I'm about that life I'm a street dude, teach dudes to think quicker Would take over the world, but you I dream bigger Never satisfied, I'm trying to be richer And pour out a little bit for those who ain't with us Ready, ready, I don't get ready, I stay ready Cause the consequences is heavy My man D said we never quit Even though the thing's heavy We push like a 7-7 seven, seven Chevy Boy, ready, ready My whole clique since 06 Was on the bottom, now we running this Grind hard when the low gets heavy The money was slow, but now it's ready You boys is not ready Good evening and welcome to all of those tuning in to our WHS TV coverage of our ma annual Maslin Beat McKinley Parade. I'm Xavier Bassett here with Joe. Hi, I'm Joe Kulisar. <laughs> and we'll be commentating over this parade as we can. Here comes the Maslin Tiger Swing Band. I will step back so you can listen.
here is our Maslin Mayor, Kathy. Coming by right now are members of our homecoming court. Here's some nice cheerleaders. Junior high cheerleaders. some of our master team mothers.
some of our Mass and Tiger band boosters. With Luthie's telling. some of our freshman football. seventh grade football players here. Being driven by Barron's Tree. WHS Alumni Association.
That was Jamie Salutes, who's currently running for mayor. is Holly Brian Keith. Some people, Maslin United banner. Of our youth football players. This was Nate Moore. Cajun barbecue.
Starlight dance truck. Village Idiots bus. Some people from Chris T's Dance Emporium. some of our Maslin 10U flag football players. Now some of our Maslin 8U flag football players. Johnny Mayer, Maston Clerk Court.
what happened. Lady Tigers basketball. I believe that is the Michelin man. Ebert Sons Trees. Under the sun. First choice pest management truck. Step Club.
drop. Like football. flag football. Yeah, under construction. Twenty four seven towing. and Tiger Calliope.
appreciate it. Here's Dewan Owens.
Speaks out loud Dust is in cages It's on raise loose Just have to make it With someone I chose Bactyl Excavating has been serving Maslin and the surrounding area since 2000. We specialize in residential, commercial, industrial site work, and utility installation. Our primary focus is our people. Bactyl Excavating invests in its people by providing the best training and equipment possible to complete projects safely, efficiently, and with great quality. Whether you're looking to build a career or your next construction project, give us a call. Bactyl Excavating. At Friends and Family Credit Union, you, the members, are the owners. Our friendly staff serves over 11,000 members, assisting with their financial needs and bettering their lifestyles. Hi, I'm Gina, President and CEO of Friends and Family Credit Union, where we provide loans, savings, checking, and other financial services to anyone who lives, works, worships, or attends school in Stark County. Are you looking for something different? Stop in today to become a friend of the family. I'm here with Cheyenne, Avea, Alina. All right. What does OB stand for? Oh, <laughs> stands for something. <laughs> I don't know. I thought it was just the tiger. <laughs> hey. um, OB stands for something. Since when? Oh, Did you know OB wait. stands no. for something? No. Oh well. I mean, do we have a guess? Uh, no. Mm. Um, no. It's OB the Tiger, that's what they named him. I'm here with... Owen Blankenship. Uh, what was the last year that we had the real life OB the Tiger? When was the last McKinley game? I'm gonna say last year. Ah. I am here with... Mrs. Hathaway. Okay. 
what was the last year that we had the Obi the Tiger, the real mascot? Oh my gosh, I should totally know this. Because Bobby Hollander used to take care of the tiger. And by the way, my house has one of the Obi cages in it, in the basement, where they used to keep the real Obi for eight seasons. So I have a tiger cage in my basement. And the last year was, what is it, 2023 right now? Yes. So the last year was 2018, maybe. I'm here with? Winter. All right. When was the first Maslin versus McKinley battle? Like the first game? Like the first game? The first game. Oh, I don't even know. Like 19... I don't even know. Like 19 something. 1975. I am here with? Melissa. Michelle. All right. Here's your question. What does OB stand for? Orange and black is everything. Football is without a doubt the most popular sport in all of America. Here in Maslin, it is an important part of the city's history and culture. Many Maslin kids aspire to be on the team and play for the Tigers. Today, I want to experience for myself what it is like to train to play football. The only problem is I have no idea what I'm doing. Now we're here in an indoor facility. We're going to be putting into practice what we learned earlier. And first, I'm going to be trying to throw the football as far as I can. Okay, so I threw it 16 yards. I think that's pretty good. Um, I think I'm going to be in the NFL pretty soon here. And now we're going to be kicking the ball. I don't have a kick stand because I, I wasn't thinking about that. So I'm just going to put it on the floor and hope that it goes well. So I kicked that football 29 yards. Um, Coach Moore, if you're watching this, I think you should put me on the Tigers as a kicker. Uh, I think pretty good there. So now we're going to be catching. Um, remember to always catch with your fingers. That's really all I know about this. I don't know how to catch. Now we're going to test my running. It's one of the most important parts of football. I'm going to be running from here all the way down there and then back. And we're going to time it and see how fast I am. Okay, so uh, I did that in 36 seconds. I feel like I'm about to pass out. I think I'll be pretty good on track though. <sighs> Logan, if you're watching this, I'm gonna beat your time. <sighs> I'm coming for you. <sighs> I'm gonna, I'm gonna be tackling. I'm gonna tackle this thing. I don't know what it's called. And so now I'm gonna do these pushing things. I think I have to make it like all the way back here. So I'll see if I can do that. Now we're going to do something very important in football, I think, which is we're going to fake them out somehow. Uh. Now we're going to do something that's even more important for football, which is jumping. We're going to jump up on this thing. And that's all we have for today. Um, I'm, I say I'm pretty good at football, honestly. Like, they should put me in the McKinley game. It's number zero, player of the week. Um, I'll see you again next time whenever I'm on accident. Your first set of wheels didn't come with complications or strings or hassles. It can be that way again. There's a simpler way to buy tires at Tire Pros. We're hassle free, guaranteed. There was a time when 10 miles to the gallon was acceptable. Today's 40 plus mile per gallon cars weren't even in the rear view mirror back then. Of course, this Linux air conditioner wasn't on the radar either. It's solar ready 
the quietest, most energy efficient air conditioner you can own. It's time to live in the now. Call Reliable Heating and Cooling for the most advanced technology in heating and air conditioning. When you're ready to live in the now, call Reliable Heating and Cooling. Lennox. Air is life. Make it perfect. Cosmos Grill in downtown Madison has a great new lineup this season. Cosmos welcomes football fans in for Friday Night Lights every Friday from 9 to midnight during the football season. Enjoy all happy hour food and beverage specials after the game. Regular happy hour specials are featured Monday through Friday from 2 to 5 p.m. Cosmos can also host your holiday banquets and parties. Check out Thrifty Thursdays and 10 lunch items under $10. All available at Cosmos Grill in downtown Maslin. My name is Jaden Wilson and you're watching the Beat McKinley channel only on WHS TV. The Eye of the Tiger. Good morning students of Washington High School. Student Council is pleased to present this year's contestants for the 2023 Sexy Likes competition. During lunch mods of Beat McKinley Week, you will have the opportunity to donate your loose change into the container representing the pair of legs you believe are the sexiest. Whichever legs has the container that receives the most donations will be announced at the rally as the sexiest legs at WHS. Now to help you decide, each contestant will flaunt their sexy legs and an accompanying riddle will be read as a clue to the leg owner's true identity. Again, the pair of legs that receives the most donations wins, and they will be officially crowned as the sexiest legs in the school. So, without further ado, here are the contestants for the 2023 Sexy Legs competition. In a world of ball games, this man stands tall, a ginger beard and humor to ethereal. He coaches with passion, a teacher so wise, but those sexy legs, they catch every eye. Friendly and warm, he's the best in the land, with ginger charm and legs that grandly stand. In high school's bustling, vibrant fray, a senior boy with curls that gently sway. Quiet he stands, yet tiger spirit ignites his core. Behind glasses, a fire burning more and more. He'll leave a legacy, though quiet in class, a spirited heart in a world so vast. A senior boy, stocky frame and curly hair, injured knee, yet school spirit he'll declare. Through setbacks came, he'd never lose his fight, for his love of the school burned ever bright. In his heart, that spirit forever strong, a senior's legacy enduring and lifelong. Curly hair frames him as he gives his all, with school spirit blazing, he's more than a dream. His kicks are a spectacle, a mesmerizing theme, amazing legs of power, his secret well known. A senior with passion in the spotlight he's shown. A tiger's might on the field he roars, playing defense, his presence soars. Maslin's pride, never to tire, with each play sets the field on fire. Number 33 is easy to see, his sexy legs will surely be. In the Tiger Swing Band, the snare his call. Drums that beat Friday nights captivating all. A senior who shines in the halftime's glow, his music's river and rhythms flow. With sticks, he takes the stage with pride. In the high school's heartbeat, he's the rhythm's guide. In jersey number 10, a senior full of grace, a vibrant personality lighting up the place. With amazing legs, he's taken us near and far. In the game of life, he's a brilliant whirl. A senior with spirit and amazing legs that twirl. You'll see these sexy legs Friday nights on the field, either hiking the ball or blocking for his quarterback. His back might be hurt and has many concussions, that doesn't stop this tiger on Fridays, leading his team onto the field. Got an idea who has the sexiest legs? Don't forget to vote for your choice of the sexiest legs of WHS by dropping your loose change into the containers during your lunch mod this week.
Hey guys, welcome to our Beat McKinley edition of Parked in Karaoke. Today we are going to be singing some traditional songs you might be hearing around. And uh, we also have Tori here, special guest. Hello! <laughs> so, <laughs> so we're just going to get into it. Rawr. Oh, Ripley, pause. I'm gonna witch you talk. I used to bite my tongue and hold my breath. Scared to rock the boat and make a mess. So I sat quietly. I breathe politely. And you're gonna hear me Don't be boring, Ripley. You're gonna hear me And that's all for our Beat McKinley special of Parked In Karaoke. We had a lot of fun today, and we hope you could recognize the songs we sang today. Go Tigers, Beat McKinley. Wow. Roar. from T.J. Dillon's. We've been proudly serving Maslin and its community for 30 years this October. We have live music every Thursday. Why don't you guys come on down and support us anytime and go Tigers. for something different at friends and family credit union our success is defined by you our goal is to improve your financial needs and better your lifestyle friends and family credit union provides loans savings checking and other financial services to anyone who lives works worships or attends school in stark county our friendly staff is fully committed to serving over 11,000 of its members what are you waiting for stop into one of our locations today and become a friend of the family Today, reliable internet is crucial for everyone to thrive. MCTV wants to help you get connected. If you or someone in your household qualifies, the new Affordable Connectivity Program helps reduce your broadband bill by up to $30 per month. To learn more about this new opportunity, visit mctvohio.com slash ACP or acpbenefit.org. MCTV, we go the extra smile. Now I've been training for this my whole life. Carpe 
straight DM. Huh, cease the moment, right, right. We gon' turn up and rock plenty ice. This is our time. Yeah, I'm about that life. I'm a street dude, teach dudes to think quicker. Would take over the world, but you I dream bigger. Never satisfied, I'm trying to be richer. And pour out a little bit for those who ain't with us. Ready, ready. I don't get ready, I stay ready. Cause the consequences is heavy. My man D said he would never quit. Even though the thing's heavy, we push like a 7-7 seven, seven Chevy. Boy, ready, ready. My whole click since 06 was on the bottom. Now we running this. Grind hard when the low gets heavy. The money was slow, but now it's steady. You boys is not ready. What is your favorite thing about Lee McKinley Week? I'm Mr. Knight. Everybody's school spirit around the entire school, decorations, everything like that. Hi, I'm Mr. Stern uh, for Beat McKinley Week. My favorite thing is just the whole energy. I didn't really get that at my high school over at Perry. So go Tigers, Beat McKinley. You got mud on your face, you big disgrace. My name is Miss Studer. I'm the librarian here at the at the high school. And my favorite thing about Beat McKinley Week is um, seeing my family from out of town. They come up usually every year and uh, from Indiana, and we go out. My cousins and my brothers and I, we go out and watch a game together, and it's just a lot of fun. We've been doing it every year, um, mostly. So <laughs> that's my favorite thing about Beat McKinley Week is just being being with my family, watching the game, and having a good time, and uh, winning winning the game. Sing it my name is Mrs. Parr. I'm an assistant principal here at Washington High School. My favorite thing about Beat McKinley Week are the traditions that we continue to still do here at the high school. Um, I graduated in 1987, and a lot of those traditions are still going on today, and it just makes it such a special week. Hey, everybody. It's Coach Brule, phys ed teacher at the high school. Uh, my favorite part of Maslin McKinley Rivalry Week is uh, the lead up to the game, the hype, uh, the fans, the rally. I'm Coach Hose. Uh, I, I teach here at the high school. Uh, played in the Mass McKinley game a couple of years. Uh, my favorite thing of McKinley Week would probably be, I don't know, as a fan, I love just the moments leading up to the game. Um, you know, when the team's run out, the bands are playing. Uh, it's my favorite part of the game. I'm ready for the game tomorrow. I got all my stuff. I just gotta make sure Noble's all ready. Hold on, I'll call you right back. Hey Noble, where's all your gear? How are people gonna know what team you're rooting for tomorrow? What do you mean you're rooting for McKinley? Well, that's not right. Just because you're a bulldog doesn't mean you have to root for McKinley. Well, here's an idea. How about we take you downtown and get you into the tiger spirit? You ready for that, Noble? So, you still a fan of McKinley?
Paul Brown Museum at your Maslin Museum is dedicated to preserving the history of legendary coach Paul Brown and Maslin's football heritage. Explore the traditions that make Maslin's football program unique and learn about the man who helped start it all. With over a century of history, there's so much to discover. The Paul Brown Museum, open today. Fresh, great-tasting pizza can be difficult to find. Your pizza shop, located on Maslin's west side, has been making delicious pizzas since the 1960s. Their large menu includes your favorite pizzas and toppings, along with wings, pressure-fried chicken, oven-baked subs, and more. Their convenient drive through window is open. Delivery service is available, too. Your pizza shop, located on the corner of Lincoln Way West and 32nd Street Northwest in Maslin. Bactyl Excavating has been serving Maslin and the surrounding areas since 2000. We specialize in residential, commercial, industrial site work, and utility installation. Our primary focus is our people. Bactyl Excavating invests in its people by providing the best training and equipment possible to complete projects safely, efficiently, and with great quality. Whether you're looking to build a career or your next construction project, give us a call. Bactyl Excavating. Since this is the time for Maslin McKinley Week, we're going to talk about the differences between a tiger and a bulldog. Let's get started. Let's start with their height. The total height of a tiger is about 283 centimeters to 311 centimeters. While a bulldog is 4 to 30 centimeters. A male bulldog is about 51 pounds, while a male tiger is 200 or up to 680 pounds. That is a big difference compared to them both. We got their weight and their height. Now let's talk about their where they live. The tiger lives in the forests, swamps, or the scarlands. And as for a bulldog, they just live in a nice, warm, cozy home. Now, a tiger hunts its prey, while a bulldog just sits there and just be lazy. Now, what is it like to be punched by a tiger or a bulldog? Well, a bulldog won't even break skin, let me tell you that much. While a tiger, well, that... You're ending up right in the hospital if you do that. So now you can see who is more dominant. Now, who do I think is going to win in the Maslin-McKinley game? That's easy. Maslin, obviously. Let's go Tigers.
Most of us are engaged with the internet in one way or another every day. A fast, secure connection matters. It keeps us entertained, informed, engaged. MCTV cares about keeping you engaged, no matter what's thrown your way. Need an upgrade? Choose from a range of reliable options, including whole home Wi-Fi. MCTV. We go the extra smile. For more than 150 years, Boys and Girls Clubs of America have been enabling all young people to reach their full potential as productive, caring, and responsible citizens. Founded in 1936, the Boys and Girls Club of Maslin has been at the forefront of youth development, actively seeking to enrich the lives of the youth of Stark County. The Boys and Girls Club is an opportunity for young people to engage in experiences that are going to help them later in life. We are the number one youth development organization in Stark County and especially in Maslin. Those kids that need it most are here on a daily basis. The Boys and Girls Club of Maslin is instilling a sense of competence, usefulness, belonging, and influence. It used to be there were at least one if not two parents in every household. Over the past 20 years, I've seen that change to where there are no parents in households for most of the kids that we serve that need it the most. But it's allowed us to put a lot more emphasis on family planning, life skills that teach the kids how to become an adult and what their priorities are going to be just for self-sustaining. Today, over 1,200 boys and girls ages 6 to 18 call the Boys and Girls Club of Maslin their home for after school and summer programs. My focus was on making sure kids had a place to go during the summer that was full-time and structured and had more of an educational component. Along with that, we instituted after-school activities that were structured, tutoring, homework help, art classes. We understood the importance of technology. The Boys and Girls Club of Maslin is dedicated to ensuring that the community's youth have greater access to quality programs and services that will enhance their lives and shape their futures. We try to keep it very interactive with our kids. They're learning while they're here. They are getting mentored by the staff that we have in place. They're building friendships. They're connecting with people. They're connecting with each other. They know that they're here for a reason and that our purpose is to help them grow. I get to spend a lot of time with the children and um, help them out with maybe things they might, might be going through, some social issues that they may be having. We're a big family here. My goal just to be approachable for the kids, just someone they can feel comfortable talking to. I really just want to change somebody's life. It could be one person, 10 people, it, at the end of the day, it all works. Over time, the mission of the Boys and Girls Club of Maslin has been expressed in many different ways, but the essence remains the same, to inspire and enable young people to become responsible, productive, caring citizens. The competitiveness, the hard work ethic that we developed through trying to compete at the Boys and Girls Club. It actually led me into high school athletics, collegiate sports, and then the competitiveness and the hard work is something that led me into the business world where I'm at today. So I think just the drive and the competitiveness that you develop from an early age carries with you for the rest of your life. The administration, staff, and exceptional young members of the Boys and Girls Club of Maslin are what makes it a success. However, it would all not be possible without the generous and continued financial support from city and countywide organizations, foundations, corporations, and countless individuals. We have some government grants, we have foundations that help us out, um, but a lot of it is you know, through purely the donations of people in this community that really helps continue to fund this place and continue to make sure that we're able to provide the services and to really make those things function and keep them properly staffed. We very much need for individuals to understand the ability the club has to reach the kids of our community and to put forth that effort to make donations that they know are going to the general operations of the Boys and Girls Club to keep it going strong. The greatest contributions to the lives of our youth are communities, 
our nation, and the world are the life lessons taught every moment of every hour of every club day. Through the Boys and Girls Club in Maslin, I have learned to live life every day. I have learned to value what I have and show others how much I love and care for them. I have learned that it is important to do the right thing even when no one's looking. I have learned that to the world I may be one person, but to one person I may be the world. I have learned that it does not matter where I come from, it only matters where I am going. With your support, the youth of today become the leaders of tomorrow. The Boys and Girls Club of Maslin. Great futures start here.